Hello guys, this is Vikram Dhara from St. Xavier's College, Kolkata. I'm back again with a new practical video that is DNA extraction from banana sample. So, all of you know that the DNA's sugar phosphate backbone is charged. By adding the salt, we help neutralize the DNA charge and make the molecule less hydrophilic meaning it become less soluble in water the salt also helps to remove proteins that are bound to the dna and to keep the proteins dissolved in the water but before that can work we need to break open the cells to release the dna you may have seen that many of the channels in the video they're using liquid soap for this purpose the soap will also cut through cell walls because the membranes surrounding the cells are made up of fats and proteins the detergent soap pulls apart the membranes releasing the DNA so here we have added some of that liquid detergent here you can see that first we are taking the edible part of the banana and putting it inside the zipper bag now we have to smash it well and mix it well with the solution of liquid soap and salt to break the membrane structure and to release the DNA the solution is ready now we have to separate the dissolved part we are taking the filtrate in a beaker So this is the filtrate. Now we are going to add chilled isopropanol into this solution. This is a less polar solution, the isopropyl alcohol on top of the mixture containing salt water, soap and cells. The alcohol makes the water molecule less interested in interacting with the DNA so the alcohol isn't as attracted to the DNA or the sodium for that matter allowing the sodium ions to interact with the DNA molecules more easily you can see the DNA threads here, they are being isolated from the solution. All the DNA threads are clearly visible here. A cotton structure. So, you can see the DNA in this photograph also. Thank you for watching this video. Please share this video with your friends and students. Thank you.